You? How many acres of land are there in this village? Hundred acres, sir. And how many bags of grain do you produce in an acre? Twenty bags each, sir. Good. What kind of grain? Rice and a little bit of pulses, sir. Whoa! How do you know all these things? Who are you? I am the patwari of this village. How can I prove that I own this pen? I can't really. But I don't really need to. I just carry it with me. Unless I lose it somewhere or someone steals it from me. It's mine. It's pretty logical, right? I don't need any proof. Things are simple with something small and insignificant like a pen. But what about something larger? Something more meaningful? Something that you can't carry around in your pocket. Like land. How do you prove that a piece of land belongs to someone? If someone says that he or she owns land, how can we confirm it? Anyone can claim anything, right? And the owner of the land cannot carry it with him everywhere like this pen. If someone wants to buy land, how does he or she know that the seller is not fooling the buyer? There has to be some proof, right? That's why we have land records. A land record is given to the owner by the government and is the proof to show that someone owns a piece of land. These land records are called khasras. It's like a certificate given to you by your school when you win a running race. It proves that you are the winner. Now imagine if there were no certificates or prizes. Everyone would just claim that they won the race because there would be no way to verify it, right? Now, going back to land records. Initially, the British started giving these records to farmers in India. We've been following the same system of government since then. Who gives these certificates to farmers? Someone has to be responsible, right? Well, the person who is supposed to do this job is the Patwari. In different parts of India, the same officer is called Lekhpal, Kanungo, Karamchari or the village officer. The Patwari has many responsibilities. The Patwari has to ensure that land records of all people in a village or a group of villages is properly maintained. He has to update it as and when the ownership of the land changes. A Patwari should know the crops that are being grown in the area just in case the government is planning to build a go-down or something and wants to know. In addition to this, he has to collect the land revenue of the entire village. Land revenue? What's that? Well, if you own a piece of land, you have to pay a certain amount of money to the government. The money collected by the government from someone who owns land is called land revenue. Revenue from land. This land revenue is later used by the government to provide facilities like roads, schools and water supply to villages. The role played by the Patwari in collecting, preparing and maintaining land records is very important. Without these records, it would be hard for the government to collect revenues. Without land records, it will be difficult to identify the real owners of the land. Just imagine a world without patwaris. It would be so chaotic. If you like this video and want to watch many many more amazing videos like these, like and subscribe to our channel now.